I'd like to welcome you all today to al algebraically attempted Corky. This is probably going to be one of the most bizarre ones that we've done because it comes with an accompanying trailer and um, it is incredible. I can't iterate this enough. You need to prepare yourself. If this goes, if this is a tuber, I'm afraid this is some sincerely copyrighted music. So you may have to check the link to the description or the card that we may put up there. This is a super saiyan. You could just call this a super saiyan too. Just wait. <laughs> <laughs> And that is the trailer for what we're going to be doing today. And it's just called 30 hours of editing. <laughs> so let's get into things. Like the video, give me a comment for the algorithm. And we don't like to ask for subscriptions here. Instead, we compete for them in rock, paper, scissors. And if you lose, you have to subscribe to the channel. So here we go. Three, two, one. You just possibly lost to a pre-recorded video. So go on ahead and subscribe and enjoy the video. Don't forget our new line duality is out right now. Get it before it's gone. Check out the link in the description to shop psycho.com. So Colt said he put in a hundred hours of effort into this whole thing, including I, I, simultaneously the worst and best PDF file I've probably ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> honest. <laughs> so this is artillery mage Corky. The theory, what if I told you there's a League of Legends champion who has an ability that can deal upwards of 500 to 1200 damage on a 2 second cooldown that has a range of up to 1600. That's like firing from outside the range of one side of a turret and hitting an enemy on the opposite. The build is a hybrid build for Corky. It focuses on building items which have passes that amplify long range damage while stacking as much AD as possible. Artillery Mage Corky follows a very specific core build that is done to mathematically maximize the hybrid nature of Corky's ability scaling at different levels, gold efficiency, and item and level power spikes. The start, tier and two pots, Caulfield's Hammer, Hexic Alternator, Complete Mana Moon, Complete Horizon Focus, Mythic slash Mythic Ludens or Shield Bow, and the boots can be completed anytime at convenience. The last two items are flexible, but in almost all circumstances, must be 80 items. Uh, here are some good options Serodus Grudge, Essence Reaver, Yuma's Ghostblade, The Collector, Utility, Ravenous Hydra, Kenpunk Chainsword, Serpent's Fang, Mama Mortius, Death Dance, Guardian Angel, Silvermere, Dawn for Survivability. The math here is a graph proving that this is the optimal build path versus. Versus completing items sequentially. Let me have a look at the numbers. Sure. <laughs> the the author of this graph just said, you can see the little blue line at the bottom start is higher than all the others. That's why it's better. Yes. Correct. Yeah, ah, yes, I see. There's a little there. Yes, understandable. Here is a chart comparing and proving the viability of Art Artillery Mage Corky. Runes are more flexible. I encourage players to run whatever they find comfortable. However, there are some I recommend. Summon area or phase rush for banned matchups. Why summon area over calm? I have tested summon area versus calm over 50 games. 95% of the time, area does more damage both early and late game. Is there an option for good matchups? Oh, wait, no, phase rush is the banned matchup. Oh, I'm blurry! And we're back in the room. If anyone is interested in the mathematics on the spreadsheets and graphs, they will be on the next two slides, otherwise have fun. Let me try and have a look at this. I have, quite frankly, absolutely no idea what I am looking at. We're gonna send it. I see Cor. Uh, you know, I see. I went, when we were doing Toy Tribals, I saw Corky play a lot. I and I, 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 I respect the pick. I just, I just for me, I really like Corky. I wish I could play more, but I just feel like he's like, he's like, he's kind of like Cassidy, like like old Cassidy, where he has like such a, a weird early that doesn't seem to come online until he's like level sixteen. <laughs> I think we should be all right. I think I, I don't want to overstep my boundaries on this lane too much. Do you know what I learned today? And I, I, I've been holding this in. We've been streaming for like you know maybe half an hour. I've been holding this in the whole time. Did you know that pineapples take four years to get to like the size that we know pineapples to be? What? Like what? Are, like what? What do you mean? What? Like I, you know what? Do you know what my immediate thought was? Like oh man, what if they just forget to like plant the pineapple trees or bushes? I'm assuming it's trees that they grow on or bushes that they grow in. What if they just forget to plant them one year and then we have to wait four years to have more pineapples? What the hell? <laughs> I'm missing CS, but it's for pineapples, so it's fine. They grow out of the ground. See, like, 
RuneScape has would lead me to believe that they come from trees. I'm not even a big pineapple fan. I'm just thinking about all the pineapple stands out there. It's like if BTS didn't drop an album for like four years, people would be going crazy. Twenty-four months to grow, then six months to grow the fruit. Six months to start the cycle all over again. That's absurd, dude. I can't even imagine from like a, a financial standpoint how much of a risk you have to be taking to invest in like a pineapple farm, right? Like you'd have to like if you were if you went to your like the bank was like I'd like to take out a loan on pineapple. Like what and wait they're like, what's your business idea? And they're like, I'm gonna start a pine What? Mr. Cannon, don't about pineapples, man. I like to I'd like to take out a loan to start a pineapple farm. They'd be like, Alright, what's like uh your business plan is like I plant it and then four years later I harvest it and then maybe sell it. They would laugh you out the building. We sponsor a trip to a pineapple farm for Ross. Kids in my in my high school used to get that all the time. They were like the uh, the ne'er do wells, like the the they're, it was called like Rathbone or something, and it was all the kids that were like genuinely like would start fights with teachers and like just scrap at any given moment, and they always got to go like kayaking and stuff, dude. I was so jealous. Not jealous enough to actually act out, but I think it's because he just wanted them out of the school because they were too much trouble. But they got to like go on all these field trips and like all this stuff. They basically had to do like no work as well. Super annoying. I hated it. Felt very sad. Back in the old days, they would just rent pineapples for parties. They wouldn't even eat them, just put them on display as a way to show off their money. How long do pineapples la like, long like last before they spoil? Because pears, they have like a half-life of about three and a half minutes where they're actually ripe and then the rest of the time they're mush. So they, it's either like eating sand or uh, like you're you're biting into mush. I mean, I've heard that ripe pears exist, but I've never seen one. So I'm not sure who to believe. I have to say, we're, oh, we're, we're seven minutes into this game and I haven't died yet, which can only mean big things. Am I dead here? You know, there was a period of time where I was like, I don't know what's happening. And also, why did she take no damage? I think I missed Q. But I feel like she shouldn't have been able to do that. But I got a cow. I, I, I'm struggling to find an opportunity here. We don't really have much in the way of freaking anything. I'm, I'm gonna, it's gonna end up running out. But like, if we could get a collapse going here. Whee! Oh, baby! I even, it was like I was playing freaking Call of Duty, did I? I even led the shot on the, uh, the the package there. Do we have Pryo? I, I don't think we do, but I think we just, you know what? Why not, right? <laughs> Whatever. Just another Tuesday in the office. Let's go for it. Yeah, my CS is not great, but I feel like the, this is definitely up the ante for me. Oh, dude, that is a, that is a dirty bag right there, dude. Woo! When's my package back up? Oh, 13 seconds. You know what? Um, <gasps> okay. Uh, my package is in five seconds. I mean, realistically, like, uh, we're looking at a dragon here, so I'm gonna wait for the package. There we go. Time to roll. I think they, I think they, they greet and make a mistake here with car key package up. Diana, I need you to go and get me some intel. Oh my god. Big F true. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Insane! Inhuman reactions! I got spell shielded by Morgana! No! No, the spell shield! You're kidding me! I flashed to go over the wall with her in the Morgana spell shield stopped. <laughs> my god. I have never had that happen to me before. It's absurd. Oh my god. I can't believe it. For anybody that isn't fully aware, it's because it's because a Kali hit it, so it counts as an enemy spell. So it blocks the effect. If if I hit it, it would I would have gone over, but because a Kali hit it, it counts it counts as an enemy spell. That is a tragedy of the maximum scale. I, I'm honestly like shook that that even happened to begin with. You know what? We get that. Why not? I thought that if you uh, if you had it yourself or your teammate had it, it counts as um like uh good times. I don't know what I mean by it counts as good times. Just take it as what you will.
What? Where are they? Yes! 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 Triple kill for algebraically attempted Corky, dude. Very nice. Oh, that, dude, that dinked, what the hell? <laughs> And I mean, I know you're still there. I don't care if you shred, I can still guess. <laughs> you know, I missed a cannon, but uh, we got the kill, so it was very just. Come down here, come down here. You, actually, you know, you're probably right. Actually, they're probably dead. What are they doing? So anyway, I started blasting. <laughs> Anyway, I'm seven and one. I do like that that is the, the real game plan for Corky. It's just so anyway. Yeah, I started blasting him. I'm starting to I'm starting to hit hard. How hard am I hitting though? Ooh. Okay, never mind. Not hard enough that I can just not Okay. I pressed R before I <laughs> got ambitious. <laughs> Why well, I, I I must I always do this. Why do I always do this? I thought I could just send it, but it didn't it didn't happen. The what it drop, it always inspires me to make the worst, least effective play I could ever make. Which is ironic because the first two were great and worked. But then I go I then I was seven and one. And then I was like, I'm really strong, I'll never die. I am I'm like the guy from James Bond who's like, I am invincible. But it turns out that's not true. That's not true even a little bit. But we have learned our lesson, for sure. Turns out that even a 1 in 4 bell cause always still does some damage. Turns out that Akali is always going to be Akali. Uh, no matter how you slice it, really. Uh, okay, turns out you can't go over that wall. It's just impossible. It doesn't work. It literally is impossible. Okay, I think I'm uh, in a pickle here. Run, little rabbit, run. Run, little rabbit. <laughs> Ooh. You're kind of spooky, dude. Hey, get out of here. Oh, my God. Go on, ult me again. Woo! <laughs> dude. I actually range you did I uh, not outrange twice in a row he's done that twice in a row That is a crazy crazy thing you just did there Why would you not ollie me? Oh, Jesus she's going really fast dude I'll just lay down the artillery fire here on the on the on the line here Come on then! Come on then! Come on then! Take that totally fire! What do you mean, man? She all attacked me one time! How much damage did I take? What? Okay, she probably hit that more than that, man. I'm sick of that stupid champ, man. She's got pro bell and a donyas and I just got like half health. I had dingy as well. Just gonna do this. I'm daunted. Dear God. God son. Missed it. Oh my god, I'm doomed. Wait, we need we need we need team here. We need team. We need team. We need team. I don't need I don't want to see Diana fucking ball. I, I, we need team. They're they're air ramming us. We need to we need to have that. Be no, what are you fucking doing, dude? What is wrong? What are you fucking up to? Oh my god. Wait, I'm, I'll be I'll be real. We need to make something happen here. Like you just need to like do something so I can actually come in on it. I'm I'm not the one that's to be engaging here. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, 
Oh my god. It's good game! That, that was probably a really bad play for me. It was only like a one-man only. I just need to play like... I mean, it's artillery fire. So like, honestly, it doesn't even make sense for me to be diving in. Man, I did like actually no damage to him there. <laughs> did lots of damage to those though. Oh, f me. Wow. F I think that... Was that double flash from Nasus and Thingy to kill me? They ate me. I mean, I'm like the only damage on the team. We got beef, but like no damage, no damage, no damage. I could take the... I'll take the actual like freebie here. It was the, it was a guaranteed kill. I'd rather, I feel like I'd rather take that. Next fight probably ends it, so I might as well get pop. Could we trap? Or just walk up to them. That also works. You know what? Kind of did work actually, ironically. I mean, she's just out of the fight, right? Help me all you want, didn't ask, did I? Take no damage or what, man? <laughs> Come on, where is the damage? What do you mean, Severus? Do you do anything, man? You don't kill Nasus? Yeah, but like, we have other team members, man. For 40 minutes, but I'm corky, man. Come on. I'm like, literal, genuine late game, dude. Is he really a fucking Athena changed me, man? Is he serious? I do damage, but you don't, know to nobody. I'm not, I, I, I assure you, all the damage being dealt to like the the entire team is like me and Orn. <laughs> I'll tell you what though, I did get my seal approved. That was a freaking, oh. I mean, uh, to be fair, we got like hard focused that game. Even then, we did absolutely redonkulous damage. The only person to beat us was Nasus and I think he probably just wailed on David for like 40 minutes and neither of them killed each other. <laughs> you know, that was, that was a very sick build and I very much like it.